Hello everyone, I am Archer Fangs and welcome back to Digimon Story Cyber Salute. So in the last part we completed um several side cases we did um we started the uh, I'm not a flower person and then we did Red Fist and Hot Sweat and finally we ended up doing Ryota's Youth. So now we're gonna do the story mission which is Nakano Underground. This is a case from the government. The door in the Nakano underpass has been unlocked. What waits on the other side? I guess we're gonna have to find out. So we're gonna get a farm development kit. So yes. Anyways. Let's see. I'll explain the details. The client this time is a local government. Take care of utilities for Nakano. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Nothing. Let's see. We cooperated very well with Detective Matayoshi's police force. So he considers to be a pretty good detective agency. So we received a case from a public agency. Quite a rare event. This case was originally discussed by Detective Matayoshi with the government agency. It's a bit special so Detective Matayoshi passed us down to the government agency like a sort of ace up his sleeve and now is our case. Got it, alright. Alright, so the gate... The case is to unlock a gate in Nakano on the pass. It seems that the... Gate is locked due to some electronic glitch and can be opened. Alright. You don't know about Nakano Underpass? No, I do not. It's a facility that houses the equipment used to power Nakano's public utilities such as power, cables, water supplies, and so on. They are moving forward with the plan to improve the look of the city center above ground by housing the public utilities on the ground. Looks like the visible power cables and telephone poles are set to disappear in the next, in the not too distant future. Underneath Nakano, there is a vast complex of tunnels, so there are, of course, many entrances. One of these entrances is the place where the gate we need to unlock is. It is a password protected electronic lock, but it may seem some time ago a lock for no reason, and no one has been able to open it since. They contacted the manufacturer, but they gave up. It needs to be it needs if needs be they will destroy the gate, but obviously that will incur serious cost. While the costs were discussed, a weird groaning sound was heard coming from the other side of the gate. It seems something strange is going on. Alright. The manufacturer had a bad feeling about it and didn't want to open the gate, but the government suspect criminal activity and called Mateyoshi. Alright, so we need to go to that place now. You have the best people for the job if you want to access a place that is off balance to most. <clears throat> the game in question has an electronic look, so naturally there is a cyberspace inside it. You're the only one who can break into the gate without destroying it. We already received permission from the government to access the underpass. Alright, so cool. Alright then, shall we go and find out what the real situation with this underground gate is? Yes, I've been wanting to go there. I've been wanting to go there. Have you heard of the stock house stick process in quantum mechanics? I guess I should tell you about Scroll Dangerous Cat. Until we open up the game, we cannot know if we will find an underground tunnel or the void of space. Until you open that gate, the world is in a flux of overlapping possibilities, so just try to enjoy it. Let's go. This gate is a simple matter of unlocking the gate, but the case, actually. What's behind the gate? Your job is to find that. Find out. <clears throat> Alright, so... Where the heck is we supposed to go again? And then it didn't tell us where to go. Alright, so I assume you have to go to...
Oh, right here. Not kind of on the pads. All right, it's a new location, man. All right. All right. So we have to go over here. Look that. Did you arrive the underpants? Yes, I did. The key we need to lock is inside. The control panel should be beside you. Do you see it? Connect, jump into it, and lock the gate. What happened? What? Connect, jump isn't working? That's strange. It's an electronic lock, so there should be some kind of network inside it. Perhaps it's just that you didn't activate the connect jump properly. Right, I think it's time I verify your ability to perform a connect jump. Raise your hand. Now concentrate. Now what? That's it. Huh? 30, 30 minutes later. One hour later. Several hours later. One hundred years later. Okay, that's too far. <laughs> what were you doing just now? Whatever you're doing, it seems like it's not working. Okay, now nah, that worked. Oh no, it looks like I can verify it. Well, it seems like you can only connect jump if you feel disappointed. If I were to uh, post a theory as to how your connect jump works, your bullet locates a digital wave, piggybacks on it to the target location's digital space, and then enters it. It can be a network, a PC server, it doesn't matter what the target location is. If it has a digital space, then you should be able to access it. However, there seems to be certain limitations when interfering with the digital wave. In other words, when you can, you can, and when you can't, you can't. Alright, alright. Alright, alright. Can we just go move on? Yeah, yeah. See, that's one thing I don't like about the game. That they just ramble on and don't and like like that. <clears throat> So we have Tokomons in here, we have two of those, so we get 25% each, total 50. So, you guys haven't left any comments on this Digimon videos, like, you know, like, not, not that I want some, you know, like, I need to have some comments, but like, sometimes I ask if you guys wanna, uh, want me, like, suggest me to use, like, a Digimon or something like that, go for it and leave a comment, and like, oh, use Agumon, or use, um... Uh, Angemon or use Devimon or whatever it is that you can think of let me know and I'll see if I can get it if it's Only if it's in the game though. Don't be asking Pokemon that uh, Pokemon Digimon that's not in the game Like I don't think Shaman is in here. So All right, so let's go on we're gonna <clears throat> I'm gonna skip the battle. I'm not gonna fight. Oh, can I skip? Alright, so we're gonna attack them then. Power energy, we need mirror shower. Yeah, so like, comment, and subscribe if you're not watching my if you're liking my channel, watching my video and stuff like that. Alright, we got another did you text message? <clears throat> Ooh, we have Lotmon and Terriamon. Lotmon and Terriamon. There you go. So that and yeah. So if you guys want me to use one of those two Lotmon or Terriamon or Tokemon, leave in the comments below, and I'll use it. Be me like a you know DJ line like tell me like oh did you evolve it to this one and this one and that one and then finally to this mega or whatever it is. 
All right, so we have them. We got Saint Knuckles. All right, so what do we have here? There's nothing here. Hacking skill: copy and paste. Copies the target's color data and temporarily saves it by pasting on a colorless space. When currently placed, the security will be dropped and you will be able to continue. Movement to a different area will clear any copy data. Alright, so I'm assuming you have to copy and paste this yellow thing over here. Yellow sticker, yellow data. Copy and paste. Let me go over here. Then we have Tentomon. This way, we need to go this way. Oh, another battle, really? So now I can get Tentomon. Then copy and paste. We got the yellow. The door should be unlocked now. Let's head back and check. So we have to leave. And then more battles. <laughs> There's no point in fighting those Digimon. They only give you like little gen and little EXP. Let's get the heck out of here. To knock on the underbreast, yes, let's go. Checking the timer, so we got like 10 minutes in. Let's see, so we have like a little digital ship in the underpass. All right, it seems you managed to unlock the gate, so thanks for that. It must have been easy for you to give in your skill. There is a bit of a lamer in the underground tunnel. I see. It's strange to see just a small section of the lamer. <clears throat> I believe we have witnessed a special digital wave occurrence. It's as if it's some kind of a current. I see. This is definitely a ley line. You see, now that's where they go off topic, and you know, I'm like, really? Dabs, you have to tell us about all this, you know, ley line and all that kind of stuff. So they're talking about that. Just give me like some sort of, I don't even know. Like they're explaining the, what ley line is. I don't even know what it is either. I mean, I played this game before. It's been a while. It's been like, what, two, three years since I played this. So I, I can I only have like a vague memory about it. So yeah. Let's see. I do know some stuff like oh I remember that and I remember here and there but not the whole entire game. Let's see why don't you go a little further and check things out for me? Okay. I believe the lane is supposed to be because there's like a couple of streets I don't know where I think from different cities that boat meet. I'm assuming that's what it is. I don't even know, I could be wrong. <clears throat> so let's just go on. So left and right, so let's go right and see what we find. Let 
we have a dead end, so this goes all the way then. I need to backtrack on the right side of the path so I can get that box. Now uh, the question is, is there Digimon in here? Like, random encounters? Um, the tunnel just keeps going, you say. If it stays on course like that, you're going to end up in Rapongi, which will mean Rapongi. I don't know how that's the right pronunciation. You know, this reminds me of something else I heard about before. As I mentioned before, Tokyo Land Lines stem from Mount Fuji, which is of course not all right. They're going on with Land Lines. That's one thing I like about the game, though. Like, they explain everything, but I'm like, is that really necessary? You're standing at the border of the of the municipally. I don't know how you pronounce that. Uh, go any further, and you will be in the central government territory. That's a lie. We best not poke. All right. Mm -hmm. This little tension of ours has gone on long enough. I think head back the way you came and regroup at the office. Alright, I wasn't able to get the box. What the heck? Though it's not as strong as we used to. That tunnel is causing a digital shift. We should probably keep it locked up like before after all. I have no idea how I'm going to explain all of this to our client. No matter how you spend it, it's probably all be a lot to take in. I wouldn't be surprised if we come away looking even sketchier than we already do. Let's just let Detective Matthias do what they. Some jobs are just best left to others. Hmm? You're curious what exactly was actually beyond where you stopped? That makes two of us. Believe me. Actually, while you were on your way back, I decided to look into it a little bit. Apparently, what you found was a common Shiro research lab of all things. Alright. Don't be dense. I told you, that area is under the juris just jurisdiction of the central government. That's not the sort of place you want in for fun. If nothing else, it indicates that Kamen Shiro and the government have a tighter relationship than what we previously suspected. Going after Kamen Shiro will, could well mean that we also be Ruffling the garments feathers. That's why we can be hasty right now. We'll do what we can to prepare and cross that bridge when we come to it. Alright. This is just a guess on my end, but I imagine it was Kevin Shrew that changed the password on that door and rendered it impossible to get it open. They probably weren't counting on us being able to actually break in and snoop around. Knowing that, it could well serve as our ace in the hole later when the time does come to confront them. Hopefully, unawares. Alright. Enough, please. On that note, I realize this case is technically closed, but what do you say about heading over to Rapongi for me one more time? I don't mean on official business, but rather than I'm keen on doing a little independent intelligence gathering for our own internal use. Surely you're interested in knowing why Kamishiro has built a research lab underneath the Tokyo Metropolitan Government Building too, right? How about you just walk on through the front door there and see what you can find? Sounds good? I have to go back over there now. Alright. Let's see. You can go to Tokyo Metro Berlin now. Alright, let's see. I wonder if I can I get the chest? Let's go get the chest and then we'll go to the Tokyo please. Oh, I can go there. Uh, really? What's this right here? Oh, are you here for a tour of the lobby? Please come inside. Hmm. You must be confused. Let me explain. Construction on this new metropolitan building is entirely complete as of yet. 
Well, it was at one point that is until a major firm came in and it was decided the upper floors merited additional construction. As such, while that's going on, the lobby here remains free and open to the public to visit. You make it inside the building? No, I'm still outside. Alright, I get you. So they're alright with you hanging around the lobby. Well, that makes our work a little easier than going in. All you need at this point is a terminal somewhere so you can infiltrate their system. Piece of cake at this stage, I'll say. So once you find the terminal, just slip on in and work your magic like always. Wish I was there to see it myself. Seems like quite the job. It reminds me of the Tower of Bab uh, Babel anyway. Babel, I think that's how you say it. Um, guys, I'm starting to ramble again, though. No, don't worry about me, feel free to get back to work now. You know, wish they were like that throughout the you know, entire game. I was like, oh, see here, this and that, and whatever, blah, 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 and then, oh, I'm rambling again. Go on. Do your job. You know, stuff like that. But no, they keep explaining in every detail. <laughs> Alright, so, I did do it here. But I, think, I guess I'm going to leave that for the next video. I'm like, I'm already like over a couple of minutes, maybe. Maybe four or five. So yeah, I don't want to make like super long video. So yeah, so anyways, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. If, you, if you've been watching my videos and you haven't done so. Uh, if you have any suggestions, tips, or questions about the game, leave in the comments below. And make sure, make sure you hit the bell symbol so you can be notified when I upload a video. And I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.